Okay, so I'm with uh, Peter Manfredo. This is an interview with Boxing Show TV. How are you doing, Peter? I'm doing very well, thank you. Great. Listen, uh, everybody knows you. The, this uh, Contender Series put you on the map. Yes. How was your experience with the, the Contender people? The Contender people were, were great, man. They, uh, you know, definitely boosted my career, and uh, I'm so happy I've done that. And I'm, I've met great people on the show, great fighters, and I've been to a lot. I've been to uh, to world championship fights. They took me uh, to big places. Now, you know, um, I'm back down to middleweight, and uh, I'm looking to become a world champion at a division I feel I can become one. Right, and um, this fight with uh, Sergio Mora, everybody was talking about it, and uh, would you like to eventually get him back in the ring? Yeah, I think that's going to be the plan, you know, uh, when I go back down to 160, I know that fight will be happening, I know he's going to fight with Kelly Pavler coming up, uh, best of wishes and best of luck to him in that fight, but uh, uh, hopefully down the road, you know, once I get a couple wins, we can get that third fight on the roll and get, uh, get who, what the straight, who the real winner was. Sergio? He's calling you out coming, again. Coming to get you. He's coming to get you. And um, I wanted to ask you, some of your best fighters when you were growing up, who were they? Well, Vinny Paz had to be one because he was a hometown hero. But, uh, you know, Marciano, LaMata, Basilio, um, you know, Hagler, Hearns, Leonard. I mean, I... Who would, you like, who would you have loved to fight among those fighters? Back then? Probably, because I'm a, such a... I just want to fight everybody. I probably would have would have just liked to try them all. Probably wouldn't have beat any of them, but I would have loved to try it all. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I'm just a throwback to the old school. just like to fight. Um, you know, it's my living. It's what I do, and I enjoy it. Kazaki, I want to talk to you about Kazaki. You were uh, upset. Eh? The fight uh, got stopped uh, with all the punches. Did you think, while he was punching you, did you think, I'm in... Uh, I'm in his. I'm in his hometown, and maybe the fight might get stopped. Well, I don't think you think of that when when you when you're in the moment. You know, you you you're thinking about your next move, and and I was thinking about coming back with a couple of shots, but it's when I started making a miss they stopped the fight. Um, I, it was an unfair advantage, but the fight's you know, it's in the past now. You know, probably want to beat him. I mean, look at the guy. He's, he's one of the best ever. You know, he's never lost a fight. But uh, they didn't give me much of a chance out there. I didn't think that was uh, very fair. But what happens, happens. I'm, I'm moving on. Well, he's retired now and you're moving on? Yes, he's retired. Now I can move on. What do you know about uh, this upcoming fighter, Smishat? Well, he can fight. You know, I, I've... Uh, he's a pressure fighter. He's a very pressure fighter and he comes to win and he comes to fight. And, um, you know, it makes for a good fight. And it's a big test for me because I want to fight guys like John Duddy and Kelly Pavlik. And, and this guy went the distance and just about beat John Duddy. So, so you saw the fight, of course. I seen the fight. I seen the fight. And uh, did you think one? Well, it was close. It was close. You know, I because it was in Duddy's hometown, I think I gave him the favorite, favoritism. But uh, I think Wally could have got the fight. Okay. Um, but overall... You know, he's a tough fighter, and i seen that he's he's good for the first five. You know, when, when Duddy started boxing right. him, he couldn't handle it. So he's a straightforward fighter. What I have to do is give him angles, and I think it's going to be a big test for me. Good luck tomorrow night. Thank you Thank very you much. again for this okay. interview. Awesome. We'll talk soon.